This is Patrick Kral. This is his family. This is his good friend Steve. And this is Patrick doing what he loves. Jumping out of planes, running marathons, climbing mountains, turning big obstacles into victories. But for Patrick and the people who love him, it's the little everyday challenges he meets that matter just as much. The challenges most people never have to face. It was a very uh, extraordinary moment in our lives. Very extraordinary. When Patrick was just a baby, his parents learned that their little boy was born with a learning disability, one he'd have for the rest of his life. How did it make you feel? Um, it was a terrible thing, you know, it was just a terrible thing, and uh, uh, it was a shock. I mean, I always said as a young person, as a young husband, that one of the things I thought I could never deal with was having a child who was uh, intellectually disabled. It made me feel uh, that I had, to, I had to do the best I could for him. Obviously very disconcerting and we were all quite upset, but as a parent you adapt uh, and um, we did. They immersed Patrick in special programs, lobbied for mainstream schooling, and encouraged Patrick to pursue his love for sports of all kinds. In a way, their support and those experiences led him to Favar and a lifelong friend in Favar director Steve Morris. It's kind of like the little brother that I never had without the painful growing up years. <laughs> He helped me find jobs and get into Favar in the apartment. Patrick transitioned into Favar's unique residential complex, a community that helps him grow socially and feel connected. I would say I have the good the friends um, that I like that help me and they're nice. I have one roommate I'm living with now. It's helping people move into neighborhoods in the community and teaching them how to be good neighbors. And and through Favar's job placement program, he's paying his rent, doing something he enjoys. It's good physical work, it keeps busy. And We're providing a valuable service to the community. And for folks who work in community-based businesses, you know, we're, we're doing parts of the business that need to be done. Really for the first time in his life, he's got a job that he really loves. He's productive, he's making money. A good example of how he has inspired people and his, his peers at Favar is through the hiking and camping club that he and I both started. You know, that was an interest of his and mine, and we have sometimes 25 people on a hike, and a lot of people come out because it's Patrick's hiking club. He's exceeded um, most people's expectations of not just a person with an intellectual disability, but in the expectation they might have for themselves. I mean, there's not many people that can go out and run a marathon, let alone 12. There's not many people who would willingly jump out of a plane and be persistent year after year until he finally found a sucker to go with him. That sucker was me, and he loved it. Congratulations. Yeah, thanks, that was fun. And I hated it. And <laughs> uh, it's a scary, terrifying thing, but that's Patrick has helped inspire me to be more fearless myself. I'm very proud of my son. I can't believe how much he's achieved. I mean, I really can't. The idea of marathoning and run running long distances and mountain climbing, some of these extreme uh, adventures of his take enormous amount of preparation and, um, and sustained discipline. The adventuring is something that comes naturally to him, and it's inspiring and it's great to see and I, I love you know, sharing some of those experiences with him, but it's really inspiring to me to see him overcome the obstacles that he has in life and successfully overcome them. It's, that's what it's all about for me. Favar is by far the best agency we've ever, ever worked with. 
They have a very open and progressive view of how to, to do their programming and how to support individuals and give them the opportunity to be independent and make their own choices. I have a lot of goals I still want to do. Yeah. Like climb mountains, I like the outdoors, and own my own house someday. Reaching those goals may be an uphill climb, but with the support of his family and Favar, Patrick will never climb alone. Do you want to say to anyone before you do it? I'm ready to go. Life's an adventure, so go for it.